Brett Okamoto backstage at UFC 284 with Islam Makachev, who defended his lightweight championship for the first time against Alexander Volkanovsky via unanimous decision. Islam, a lot went on with the fight. It was a very close fight. Enemy territory, the crowd booing you. Just what are your thoughts? Fresh out of the octagon, what's going through your mind? You know, everybody like waiting, easy fight, but you know, 13,000 kilometers from my country, best fighter in the world and his area. I know it's not going to be easy fight, but I beat him in this decision. It was good experience for me. Did you think at all coming in? You said it wasn't going to be an easy fight, but did you underestimate Alex in anything? No, for sure. I prepared for hard, hard fight. You know, last round he landed it's good shot, uh, good, good, uh, good punch. And but all other rounds, in my my opinion, I I win. And it was good good fight, you know. And I improved a lot because last my how many fights and I never fight five rounds. That's why it's good experience. You said that uh, you felt like you won all the other rounds. Did you feel like that right away in the moment, or when the fight was over, were you nervous a little bit? Uh, honestly, I feel. I'm not lose for sure like three rounds, but before last five, five rounds, my opinion, I win all rounds. And I know I lost just last round, but you know, I told you he landed good shot in the last round. That's why I go down and try to some give him some triangle choke or arm bar. What made you feel like you were winning the fight during the first four rounds? Because there were some close rounds, at least we thought, you know, watching it. What made you feel like you were winning those rounds? Uh, first round, for sure, I landed uh, good shots many times, but this guy is so strong. He always try to push you, and his, his style, you know, a little bit different, and how he moves, like, fast, and how he's strong, you know. And he improved a lot in the ground, how he defends, but it was good fight and for sure it's big experience for me. It was right now I'm best fighter. People maybe like this or they don't like. I'm best fighter in the world right now. Yeah, and uh, it was a, a great fight, and you got to show off your striking in a way that we have never seen. Are you ha yeah. how happy or how do you feel about that? Having the opportunity that, hey, you didn't beat this guy wrestling. If yeah. you, you won this fight, you won this fight on the feet. You know, my plan not like go to the wrestling always because uh, in Australia, like many things is different. We fight, I come to the arena early morning, not many hours for the recovery and you know, many things. I don't want to say about this too much just it was crazy and good fight you know I've been in a lot of these events as you have I think that was the loudest I've ever heard a crowd when you walked out and you had all those Aussies booing you what did that feel like to be the guy right there that everybody wants to lose but you know just want to say thank you because all arena full and why we did this for these people for sure make them happy and without these people it's not possible thank you all fans around the world this is for you guys when you're on his back in a body triangle and he's screaming and punching you uh, behind you what, what's going through your mind when he's doing that I, you know <laughs> this is not he just say let's go do something but he say i improve my grappling and i ask his uh, grappling coach, hey, why you don't teach him how he defends to the triangle choke from the back? He just left, you know. You think you'll ever fight the guy again? I think the people will be interested in it. Why not? If you see one, let's go. Let's do this again. And final thing for you, um, was it maybe a good thing that Habib wasn't here? You might have given him a heart attack there. How, how would he have reacted to this fight and have he you talked to him? Me, yet? He said, I've become old now. And he said, sometimes you need this. Sometimes you need this experience and I told him hey, if you come here it was be like more easy but it's okay. He say come back we're gonna work to the mistake and back to the fight.
It was one of the best fights I've ever seen, man. Congratulations on the victory and look forward to your next one, man.